Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Kanae Shane again, and I'm back with another video. And it's another natural hair video. So today I am going to be attempting some Bantu knots on my natural hair. And this what you see me applying is just some Shea Moisture leave-in conditioner because I want my hair to stay moisturized, whites and knots, you know what I'm saying? So that's what that was. And then this I'm going in with is some curl stretch pudding to basically kind of like help curl my hair and keep my hair stretched. Now this is my first time using it, so I don't know how it works, but we will see. And I just want to make sure that I got it completely moisturized in, but this is my first time doing Bantu Night. So I don't know how it's going to turn out. I don't know how it's going to look. And as you can see, it was taking me forever in a day to like get my flow with twisting it so it can knot up. So yeah, that's that. And I will go in and show you guys what I'm doing and how I'm doing it, like, you know, from there. But basically, I just took my hair and I twisted it until it started, like, rolling up on its own into a knot. And then my ends, I made sure they were slick and I wrapped it around. So that's how you do a bend to knot. And you guys will see, like, further along in the video. So, yeah, that's that. So yeah, pretty much you just keep on doing your knots until you work your way up. And this is how many I got so far. Now my hair is short, so I did do mine's a little bit smaller. But um, as you can see, my parts are not perfect. I wanted to really like freestyle part. I didn't want any perfect parts. So I was just going through my nail and parting. But that's how it turned out. And yeah, you pretty much just got to make sure your hair is smooth and keep working your way up until you are done but you want to make sure your hair is moisturized when you do it you got to make sure your hair is wet so that's why i kept going in like water adding my conditioner and going from there because my hair was like kind of i ain't gonna say it was dry by the time i got to the top but it was definitely like you know damp and i wanted my hair to be like a little drenched if possible before i did the knots so that's what you guys see me going in doing just moisturizing more because i really want my curls to pop and this video let me let y'all know this video was inspired by another youtuber and i see how hers was popping her hair was longer than mine so um yeah i just was hoping that my curls turned out the same way Different places, different faces that I've seen Out of all the places that I've been Nothing tops the Medellin Before the world became a meme Before we were a thing We used to fantasize about our biggest dreams Hearts collide, paramedics hit the scene Just another casualty I know you draws in for someone that gets you wetter 
I wanna do you better Feeling this excitement because you want me Holding it all together But the regret is letting you up Can't say the same thing I moved on Tell me was it worth all the anxiety Hearts collide Feeling inside burning you up Another casket, baby. I've been losing people over shadiness. You say you've been praying, trying to change me. Selling me the wanna make me slip. I know, keep my grip for sure. I can't lose control. You've been trying to set me up. Talking like you love me, and etc. Givenchy, Givenchy, Dolce and Gabbana. That's all you want, that's all you wanna do. I won't be the one to play the fool. No, I won't be the one to play the fool. Ah. Here we go. In my arms, you once lay. Now you're gone. Let me know. Am I? so this is four days later you guys i really like kept these in oh yeah and i didn't tell y'all that i bobby pinned them now because my hair was like unraveling when i was trying to do them so yeah i did bobby pin them all down so this is me just going through taking all the bobby pins out because i'm about to unravel them but i left it in for four days so my hair should like be extremely extremely curled like hoping that these things pop but we're gonna see i'm praying y'all because i'm i was really like scared but y'all i don't know y'all know how like sometimes you do a hairstyle and you hope that it look like the person who inspired you to do it and you just go from there but yeah that's what this was and then that y'all know my famous wild growth <laughs> that i love i use it all the time that's what's making my hair grow so fast and i've been using this product for years but i really just went in and like greased my scalp before i did anything because i wanted to make sure that my hair was like moisturizing oiled or whatever and y'all see that drip down don't pay attention to that but y'all know my edges fell out and y'all see how it has grown yes honey yes the edges back in edges where right there So, of course, because my hair was so short and because of the length, I wasn't really feeling like the curls at all. I felt like if my hair was longer, I would have been feeling it. But, I mean, the curl pattern was cute. It was just not for me. It looked like I just took down some, like, braids or twists or something. But, I don't know. We're going to see. Y'all know I, if, if stuff don't turn out the way I like, y'all know I, I go in and, like, hook it up myself or try to do something else to it and just turn it into something different so that's pretty much what i was doing right here and that little twist right there that little strand ahead that y'all see so that was something that accidentally got left out of a vent tonight and i tried to like go in and wrap it 
and see how I like it from there. But yeah, these are the curls and this is how it turned out. But I don't know. I think my hair was just kind of like too frizzy for it. Or better yet, I really think that my Bantu knots was just too small. I should have done them bigger. I do want to attempt to try this hairstyle again. I'm going to wait till my hair gets some length on it, though, before I try it again. But I really think my Bantu knots was too small. And that's why my curls was, like, so small. And that's also why I feel like my hair looked it a little frizzy when I did the knots. But, I mean, it is what it is. Like... You know, we got to make some out of nothing. I got to remember that my hair is not long and flawless and popping. I did start over. So I feel like I'm going through, like, not the ugly stage, but the not ugly anymore stage. But I'm I'm finna get into that popping stage. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how to explain it, but that's what's going on here. and you guys this is the finished look and as you can tell i was like ready to cry because I wasted I feel like I really wasted my time now like I said some of the girl the curls was popping but the rest it was giving Norbit picked out Norbit from when he went to the but I don't know if y'all seen Norbit if y'all haven't go watch it but when he went to that barbershop and got his fro picked out that's what this hairstyle was giving and so this is me going in with my pick trying to lift it and make it look a little bit even try to do something because i i just didn't have no hope in this hairstyle and i didn't know that it was gonna look the way that it looked and i was like really devastated so this is me trying to revive or put some life or anything up into that hairstyle So at this point, you guys, these Bantu knots cannot be saved. The curls cannot be saved. So I did my signature move, went in with a headband and threw that thing on and called it a day because some of the curls was cute and some was frizzy. And I believe it was because when I took my Bantu knot down, um, I believe I wrapped some of them the wrong way. So that's why some was cute and some of the curls were not. And this, I always do this when I don't like a hairstyle, but like I said, I am going through my short stage right now. So it is what it is. But y'all know I'm honest about whether I like something or I don't. But if you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you did this hairstyle before or whatever you did to make yours look better. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will be dropping more natural hair videos and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.